Repairing the spider shaft in an old differential requires a methodical approach as it plays a crucial role in transferring torque between the wheels. Here's a step-by-step -step guide to repairing the spider shaft. Tools needed. Jack and jack stands. Wrenches and socket set. Screwdrivers. Gear puller. Hammer and punch. Bearing puller press. Torque wrench. Lubricant or grease. Replacement spider gears and shaft. Shop manual for your specific vehicle. Procedure. 1. Safety first. Park the vehicle on a flat surface. Engage the parking brake and block the front wheels. Raise the rear of the vehicle using a jack and place it securely on jack stands. 2. Remove the differential cover. Place a drain pan underneath the differential to catch fluid. Remove the bolts holding the differential cover and allow the gear oil to drain. After draining, remove the cover completely to expose the differential. 3. Inspect the components. Look for any visible damage or wear on the spider gears and spider shaft. Check for signs of pitting, excessive wear, or missing teeth on the gears. 4. Remove the axles. If the axles block access to the spider gears, you may need to remove them. Typically, this involves removing the C-clips from the axles inside the differential. Push the axles inward slightly to release the C-clips, then pull the axles out. 5. Remove the spider gears and shaft. Remove the pinion shaft lock bolt. This is a small bolt that holds the spider gear shaft in place. Slide the spider gear shaft out carefully. With the pin removed, the spider gears can usually be rotated out by hand. Be cautious, as they might fall out. 6. Inspect the spider shaft and gears. Check for wear on the spider shaft and gears. If there is significant wear, they need to be replaced. Inspect the differential housing for damage as well. If the housing is damaged, it may need professional repairs or replacement. 7. Replace or repair the spider shaft. If the spider shaft is worn, replace it with a new one. Make sure to inspect the bushings and bearings that support the shaft. Replace them if worn. If only slight wear exists, you might be able to smooth out the surface with fine sandpaper, but replacement is generally recommended for durability. 8. Reinstall the spider gears. Lubricate the spider gears with differential oil or grease. Position the spider gears back into the differential housing, ensuring proper alignment. Insert the spider shaft back into place and reinstall the retaining bolt. 9. Reassemble the axles. Slide the axles back into the differential. Reinstall the C-clips and ensure they are secure. Push the axles outward slightly to seat the C-clips in place. 10. Reinstall the differential cover. Clean the mating surface of the differential housing and cover. Apply a new gasket or gasket sealant as required. Reinstall the differential cover and tighten the bolts evenly in a crisscross pattern. 11. Refill the differential with gear oil. Remove the fill plug from the differential housing and refill with the appropriate type and amount of gear oil. Reinstall the fill plug when the oil reaches the correct level. 12. Test the repair. Lower the vehicle from the jack stands and test the differential by driving slowly in a controlled environment. Listen for any unusual noises and ensure smooth operation. Additional tips. If you're unsure about the severity of the wear or the extent of repairs needed, consult with a professional mechanic. Always follow the specifications outlined in your vehicle's shop manual for torque settings and fluid levels. 
Working on the differential can be a bit tricky due to the tight tolerances and precision required, so ensure you have the right tools and parts on hand. By following these steps, you should be able to repair or replace the spider shaft and ensure your differential is functioning properly.